Catholic Archbishop of Kaduna Diocese, Most Reverend Dr. Matthew Undagoso, has said that Catholics could not afford to be left behind in the digital space. He said there is need to raise awareness among all the departments in Catholic establishments, especially in Kaduna, on effective use of social media to the advantage of the gospel of Jesus Christ. The Archbishop, who was speaking during the 9th Kaduna Catholic Archdiocesan Pastoral Council General Assembly held at Catholic Social Center, said his leadership understands that majority of youth are on social media, and one social media platform from all the other engages the youth these days, hence deliberate efforts to reach and encourage them to the advantage of the gospel. The media is a culture of its own. It is in a world of its own. And therefore, as we are sent to proclaim the gospel message to every nook and corner, and therefore this WWW, the World Wide Web, we have to also to evangelize it. That is why the African Synod says that uh, the, me the mass media, uh, the, me the mass media is... Uh, it has its own language, it has its own culture, it has its own traditions, and therefore we must enter into this in order to be able to communicate in the language of the people of our own time. And that is why, I mean, it is important. I mean, we just have no other way, way out. We just have to engage, not only engage in the social media, I, I, I mean, in the, um, uh, the, 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 the media, but also it needs to be evangelized because it is a world of its own because it's a culture of its own. So this means of communication needs to be evangelized. And so if otherwise, I think it can easily mess up, you know, as we know, you know, it has its uh, good and uh, bad and therefore, so this is why we're engaged in it and we have no option. And so if we have to proclaim the gospel message today to in our, because we always have to proclaim the gospel in context. And in the context where we are today, you know, our young people no longer understand the kind of language that we speak, you know. And so that is why we said maybe it is good for us to come together as a, as a family. And given the fact that the uh, means of social communication is one of our commissions. And so this year we are trying to see how best we can use these available means of communication to be able to proclaim the gospel message not only effectively but also and even more so credibly in our own age. Guest speaker at the event, Reverend Father Dominic Adeza, urged all Nigerians to stop sharing unverified news on social media. The only way you can kill fake news, don't share, don't follow, don't forward it. How do you know what is fake news? Clearly, the way the content has been designed, you will see that you should be able to judge, to see. Is this for the common good of society? What good will it do if I forward this? What harm will it do to the person who will receive it? Unfortunately, we hardly do this self-editing. We do more, less of just wondering whether that is correct or the veracity of the truth. We are too quick to press send or forward. The only way we can stop fake news Stop the spread of rumors is not to be part of those who forward the same content. We are co-creating falsehood. We are co-creating fake news. We are on the rumor mill.